printer does not work until you install the included drivers and software. So for today's video, I'm going to show you how to install a printer driver on your desktop or laptop. First thing to do is to connect all the cables on the printer's ports and plug the cable power plug to the power outlet. After connecting the printer to the computer, it can be turned on using the power button on the front of the printer. Typically, the power button is on the front right corner of the printer. However, the button placement depends on the type of printer you have. After connecting the printer and turning it on, you'll need to install the printer's software and drivers. Every printer should come with the software used to install a printer in Windows or your operating system. Depending on their brand, laptops do have built-in optical drives. Locate yours and insert the CD driver. Or, you may use an external optical drive in the absence of the latter to continue the process. Now, what if after inserting the CD installer into the optical drive, nothing pops up in your desktop? Go to your search bar and type this PC. Open it and locate the CD drive. Normally, if your OS is partitioned, you can find the CD in Drive East. Double-click it to open and look for the printer installer. If you have lost the CD for your printer, you can download the drivers for your printer and use them to install your printer. A listing of printer manufacturers and links to their associated driver download pages are on our printer drivers page. In this case our printer is Epson L120, so we will go to Chrome and type Epson L120 printer driver. Click on the link under Epson website and click on the detected operating system. Click on driver and download. Click the accept button to continue downloading the driver. Wait for several minutes until it's finished. Once everything is set, click the setup or install file. If you have downloaded the drivers, run the downloaded setup file. Follow the installation wizard, and once completed, your software is installed.
Test the printer to make sure it is working.